Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. One of the things that I like to do in each of my introductory astronomy classes is to begin the class with the astronomy picture of the day from the NASA website that is apod.nasa.gov apod. And today's picture for November the 18th of 2019. Well, it is titled Passing Asteroid Arokoth. So what is this? And this is a, a image taken by the New Horizons spacecraft, actually a very short video clip. And you'll get to see this asteroid kind of oscillate back and forth. Now, if this is not an object that you've heard of, that's because it has now been officially named. And this object is known as 486958 Arokoth and was formerly called Ultima Thule. And this is an object out in the Kuiper Belt, out beyond Neptune, and a where there is a collection of icy objects. And these, this is one that was flown by by New Horizons spacecraft back in January of this year. And New Horizons, if you're familiar, also flew by Pluto back in 2015 and explored that. So it is out in the Kuiper Belt right now. And this is a short clip again showing it oscillating back and forth and showing a little bit about this object. Now, why is this so interesting? Well, this is the first time we have gotten to look at one of the small objects in the Kuiper Belt up close. We certainly have some details of Pluto that we were able to get from New Horizons. And that was great, but that was a much larger object, an object that had been uh, differentiated, that material had changed from how it originally formed. In this case, we're still seeing some of the very primitive material. And that's important to astronomers because we see it as a little bit of a piece of the materials that made up the planets in the solar system. This is what a lot of things were like uh, in the early days of the solar system four and a half billion years ago when the planets were forming when many small objects like this would come together to make the much larger planets especially those in the outer solar system. So we can see here that we have two objects stuck together and probably gently collided and just have stuck together and have remained like that for billions of years. We also see signs of impact craters. Craters exist all over the solar system. Anytime one object impacts into another with a decent force, we will dig out an impact crater. And you can see some of those scattered around, especially on the left edge of the image here. We also have noted that the larger one especially is rather flattened, which is unusual. Objects tend to be rounded at least, maybe not completely spherical on a small when they're small, but at least somewhat rounded flatter objects are relatively rare. So this is an interesting object here and in fact being significantly flattened down. So that is something to be able to, to try to study to little learn a little bit more about these objects that make up the outer portions of our solar system system in what we call the Kuiper belt. So we are very fortunate that New Horizons was able to be diverted after it passed by Pluto to be able to pass by a second object and to give us an up close look at the building blocks of our solar system. So that was our picture of the day for November the 18th of 2019. It was titled Passing Asteroid Ar Arokoth. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture, previewed to be Light the Galaxy. So we'll see what that is about tomorrow. And until then, have a great day everyone, and I will see you in class.